I actually have played this before on stream. I, I tried to do all the scenario, but I failed because it's hard as hell. Because there's no downside having a second player. A second player is like having t two shots. Yeah, it's worse. It, it's literally half. It's difficult. So and now we've got Josh here. We're going to try to get a full paper. Yeah. We're playing hard mode, so we get it all. We don't care about the screen. Yeah. This is one of the most nostalgic games ever to me. So we go, I think we have to do, it's advanced, we keep on, what's the difficulty? Yo, Oddy, you're going to like this, we'll keep on normal because this game can get hard I suppose, but we want to be able to play every stage, we want to show this game off because I think this is actually a really good game for Sega Master System. Yeah. Again, there, I do actually have a playthrough on YouTube of this, but it's single player and you didn't get to see all the stages. All right, Josh has uh, got a set of controller. Yeah, it's not the. Um... Do you know what you should do? Just get one. Just get like another Xbox One controller because that piece of shit. It, never any advice to any kid. Do not buy unofficial controllers. Not no. worth it. No. Ever. Right. <laughs> got it. All right. <laughs> oh, this one. Sh this one's crap. There are a couple of power ups in this game. That's quite awesome. Right, if anyone's confused, I'm the blue ship. I'll, I'll let it. You know. Ah, no, you got it. I think the green one might be laser. Don't spat that, yeah. He's off screen! Cheater! <laughs> that was. Oh, sh I tell you what, that's what you call broken um, gameplay. I tell you what, it's a lot more, it's much faster than I remember it. Wow. It's because when we play, in the, the PAL version is only 50 hertz, isn't it? The American is 60, so it's playing the American version, so this is faster. So let me try to explain this game a bit more in its version. Got it. We are playing every stage available. Oh, it's power up. Okay, so this is what you're looking for. Power up gives you two shots, double shot. And that's how you win this game, basically. Yeah, if, you, if, you, if I get hit once, I lose double shot. It's like actually having extra pairs on screen. It's that, it's that good. It's harder than I remember. This is quite fast. You've got a good advantage, though, to take these aliens out before the game starts. And you really want to lay it into them. I am flattening these now. However, you can triple it up. You can get triple shot as well, which is amazing. So, um, yeah, it makes life so much easier. Showed up is just like an extra life, you know, it's pretty simple stuff. There are some pretty cool power-ups that people will see on this paper. Um, but it, it's a good game, it's got pretty good graphics for Sigma System as well. I looked at old Game Master magazine that Ben had, and they gave this game 35 out of 100. I'm like, when was Space Invaders more advanced than this? Back in like, 91 or whenever this came out. It's like, I oh, don't pick it up, hold it off a little bit. Get it. There you go. So we're trying to use all the tips as possible. And there we go, that's the end of Space Invaders. <laughs> uh, right, okay, so that is shit. <laughs> <laughs> why, why did, did, I saw the screen flash. Oh, like, that's frustrating. That is one thing I should have mentioned about this game. Um, one thing I... What? I can't even stop reset it, it's off. That's that is terrible. Now, okay, well, I, I should, funny thing is, when I first played this on stream, the, the, the cart, well, we're playing on ROM, right? But the cart, the ROM was breaking down as I was playing it. Towards the end, the, the font was getting mixed up inside each other. Sure, the sound was off. This is a bad ROM, and it's funny, because I played this on a um, EverDrive, which is basically a, an original cart with an SD card in, and to play on original hardware. And even that, on original hardware, this game was crashing a bit on that. It's unfortunate, whoever ripped this game didn't do a good job. Oh, do you know what? The only problem I got with this now is it could happen again. No, bless, uh... But it's part of you know, it is what it is. We're gonna try again. We're not quitters. Well, well, saying that we just literally quit out of Kadash. So we, so we are quitters. <laughs> but this is like, this is like, I can't do much about it because it's crap. Yeah. 
Shield up. Oh, fuck. I lost my double shot, which is pretty depressing. If they are random, as far as I know, it's random. I can't stress enough. It is the it is the power up you need. You need to get double shot. It's the way to beat this game. It's easier. Firing twice as fast or triple. But, you know, triple as fast is miles better than any other power you get. Because it's like the tournament until you get hit. Do I get it? I've got it. I've got the power up straight away. However, it is a bit of an ass clench. As soon as you get that power up, if I take one damage, I lose it. So you've got to be very, very careful. But you can absolutely blitz these things. And as people can tell with Space Invaders, the best strategy is to hit one row at a time. Because they've got, they got to scroll the whole screen. It slows it down. Oh, Christ, I am. Did you see that? I was completely... Oh, God. The American version is so much harder. It's too fast. Right. Do you get health or kills from those? No, you do. Well, yeah. Do we get cow levels on this room? There are cow levels in this game where cows are getting abducted by aliens, and it's quite it's quite cool to see. You literally got to shoot them out of the sky before they go off to space. They're basically getting get anal free. Oh, we missed it. That sucks. So again, I want to say again, I'm blue, drop is red. So you're going to see the blue player have much higher skill uh, capabilities. Like, like in all the games we play. If anyone's going to let the team down, it'll be the red, red, red player, I think. Sometimes, this is going to sound weird, you just don't even want to look at the aliens. You just want to look at your uh, sprite and just shoot and move around because it's easier to, you know, to avoid projectiles that way. That's a cool power-up. No. Ah. And we're even going to play the PS1 version of Space Invaders after, which actually has a pretty cool, unique uh, system where if you kill aliens with the same four colors, say you hit, you kill four blue aliens, you get like a blue power up. So you want to try to quadruple uh, kill the same types to get like the power ups. It was quite an interesting way that Ada could never, um, you know. Ah, oh, shit! I missed Josh. Good. Ah, god damn it! Oh, you got it, right, Josh? Don't mess this up. Why are you going backwards? you got to be very precise in this game. Alright, this is the first boss coming up soon. Lay it into him, Josh. I think these are splitters. I think they're splitters too. God, it's fast, isn't it? Ah, god damn it. Sometimes you just shoot and hope. You hit, you know. Because you don't want to move around too much because you might run into a projectile. Another cool thing about this game is the bosses do look pretty cool, and they do look quite intimidating in this game. Got it. Ah, shit. Come on, Josh. Oh, no. It times out. You should have got it. Ah, damn it. Remember, double shot can be turned into triple shot, so don't worry about taking another shot, because it, it, it would still work. Got it. All right. Shut up. God damn it. Go on, lay it, lay him in a bit. Look how fast you can clear your lines up to me, though. It's like a machine gun. The boss fights for this game, there's one boss in particular that I don't actually have any idea how to fight well. Ah, oh, damn it, we, can't, we keep missing these power ups. We need them. Sometimes the enemies get glitched on the side of the screen as well, they just keep going downwards, you get absolutely screwed. And you can't do shit. Oh, uh, here's first boss. Right, so smash a shove it in the middle, Josh. Stay in the middle. This one's easy. You just stay. You just go left and right. Oh, Josh lost his power. This is a very easy boss fight. This one, however, there are there's one with a soul, which I think they're hard to beat. The last boss in this game looks badass as well. I actually used it as a screensaver. So now we're we're trying to um dodge asteroids. Oh, it looks a bit busy, doesn't it? I'm gonna have to fight the right side, start getting lower. Oh, oh no, I took damage. Save me, Josh. Come on. Oh, the butterfly's nice. What would be the reference of a butterfly slowing down the um? Oddie, what would the reference be of a butterfly slowing, uh, stopping the screen? Pause. I don't understand it. Am I being stupid or is it random? 
Oh no, I missed the spaceship again. God, it's a bit busy. Yeah. It's quite cool, you can actually shoot some, some projectiles back. I believe it's the red, red projectiles you could destroy. It's the blue ones that you can't shoot yeah, through, so you have to be very careful which ones you're shooting. Yeah. I wonder what people make of the Space Invaders. Ollie, I'd love to read your comment, but um, right now... Oh god, I went straight to an asteroid. Oh, that was a lovely power-up. Pause to look at it because it's pretty. <laughs> oh, glitches! No! Alright, this boss fight... This, this, this ROM is falling apart. Guys, this is not how this boss fight is supposed to look. I promise you. What is wrong with this fucking game? Right, Josh, that middle bit. When he does that... Oh, I hate these missiles. You've got to bait them. Again, this ROM is breaking down, so you can literally see anything at this stage. We don't know. Get in the middle. Get in the middle. Right now. Go on. Oh, shit. Ah, see? No. This boss fight's horrible. There's one with a sword, off. This This ROM is falling apart as we play. I actually thought this was going to be easy. See how, like, deluded I am? I thought, yeah, we're going to play Space Invaders on PS1. Uh, Masters, beat that easy. Then we're going to do the PS1 one. Then we're going to beat Kadash. And I think, as far as it's going, we're not going to beat this. Or we're not going to beat, um... They beat Kadash. I can't... We can't fell out all three games. That's shocking. Look at this! We're already two! Where are you going? Sometimes you think, do gamble for a spaceship. Save us. Get him, Josh, come on. Oh my god, that was good. That was good. Who says Space Invaders isn't good at this? In 2023. Still intense. Still doing the business. Look at him, he's taking piss out of us. He's coming down, teasing us. I got it, I cannot believe I shot that down. Oh god. Dude. What was it? Oh god, double shot, double shot. Awesome. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. No, Josh, take it out. <laughs> Pressure. Right, just lay, lay him out. Come on. This is an ass clencher of a game, isn't it? Still. Oh, hold it, hold on to it. Good. Oh, I guess it ends on certain ways. Sometimes it doesn't. Oh, this boss is a nuisance as well. Okay, he's not as bad as the other one. Oh no, he's got them fucking missiles. How would you dodge those? Impossible. I lost my double shot. Oh god, I am so shit at this game. Get it in the middle. When's in the middle? Just smash the shit out of it. We ain't dodging these missiles anyway. Ugh, god's sake. I'm trying to push way too much. I'm trying to do as much damage as possible. We need to play better than this. We're doing sh we are doing absolute dog shit. I've lost like 12 lives already. <laughs> people, people didn't tune in to watch Josh play by himself, did they? Maybe they did. Alright, Josh, make it work. Double shot. Oh, these shit shots. Push them up. I usually push them up because they time out anyway. Right. The best power-up, if anyone's wondering, is the laser. You can actually um, flick it on and off and you can take literally rows of enemies out. It looks like a dissembled body. It does. It is a body. I got it. What a shot that was. Oh, this went quick. Just kill him off. Oh, no point to it, isn't it? Come on, Josh, faster. Oh, I was, was going to lose it anyway. You can hoard it to, and you can wipe out waves. If you're very lucky, you can wipe out a whole wave with one power up. You could hold it back. Get it. Alright, laser piece. I got it. Cheating bastards! Cheaters! <laughs> right. Oh, it died. That was dirty. They did us dirty on that one. 
They, 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 yeah, they hug the corner. How is that program correctly? Yeah, this game is cheap, by the way. That spaceship is interesting. Spaceship. That was a nice, that was a nice shot. I think the graphics are pretty good for Sega Master System. The use of color is quite good. Look at the pulsing as well, because, you know, Sega Master System was pretty primitive, really. I always felt like it had a better color palette than SNES. Uh, uh, sorry, NES. Right. Oh, power up, right, Josh got the double shot. It can be tripled up, if we're lucky. Oh, bastard. I'll have to tank the damage. Got to rather me tank it than you. You don't want to lose that power up. Oh, God, they're one of these teasing ones as well. Yeah, go on, Josh, get that power up. Get it, get it down. Nice. Go on. Oh, shields. I'm hiding the I'm gonna hide the Ah, shit. Oh, God's sake. It's getting faster, isn't it? Getting closer to the last boss. And the last boss is badass. I want to definitely get to it if we can. I think it's more of a question if the car, uh, ROM's going to hold up by crashing. I, there's no way Joshua can reach that. Look how you flattened your side. Alright. Sometimes I think I should just look at my character and not actually at the aliens so I can dodge better. Because as long as you're pressing the attack and moving back, back and forth, you're going to hit someone anyway. I think I'm paying too much attention to like... Alright, I'll try again. I've got power up. Alright, this is going to be... We're going to mince this now. Yeah, no silly mistakes. Yeah, we'll leave that on screen. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Good, grab it, grab it. Right. One. I always wanted to carry that over to a boss fight, but it never seems to work. No, I think you just get rid of it as soon as the boss fight triggers. If you saw the first time I played this on stream, um, you know the, the one when you shoot up and it takes down a whole row? It glitched and I shot it up in the sky and it took the top row down and it killed all, everything below it. Because the, the ROM was basically breaking down and I was playing it on that one as well. Oh, Josh, it's not. Oh, God. These shields are shit. We don't want shields. We want to go on the offensive. Oh. They just disappear anyway. Yeah. So just leave. We're going to do really well now, though, with these. Right, next step, triple shot. I don't like this one. Hopefully you can power it up. Oh, you got triple shot. Nice. Josh, don't get hit. Whatever you do. Yeah, um, that's a good question. I don't know if you use everything for these one. That's a good question. The good thing about um, the triple shot or double shot, you're also more you're more chance of actually smashing the spaceships down as well. You get like power ups, so it's going to equal more power ups than that. Yeah, we're flying for it now. Okay. Oh, this always reminded me of the movie Crawl. You remember Crawl? When yeah, with the beast, when she's like the princess is running through the um, the, it's, it's like his body parts. Right, get it, get it. Ah, oh, did you lose them all? Oh my god, I saved this. Do you see that? We were totally gonna get fucked then. Do you have two shots? Oh, so every time you take a damage, you lose a shot. All right, that's good. No, that's cool. I'm, I'm happy about that. When I was a kid, I always thought they were shooting apples. I was like, why are they shooting apples? Hit the arc. Ah, did you get it? Oh, God, I'm terrible. Bit, bit, Josh. Oh, hold it, hold it. Shit. Here we go. you got to be patient with it. Go on, Josh, smash it. Nice. No, it's good. It's good. You've got some out of it. All right. Oh, I was trying to see if we could get through. Look how much easier it is that you've got power ups. Yeah, you can. Yeah, Games Master. On the magazine, they gave this. Oh, not this bastard. Like, smash Shadow before he does anything. No, this goes easy, actually. Oh, fuck me. I took a damage, and you did. You have three shots? 
I'm yeah, sure I... someone else took a damage. Maybe it's me. I actually think this might be one of the last levels before the boss. Actually, that blue eye on the left looked like we were there a second ago. Alright, I think the final boss might be after this one, maybe. Alright, let's get a double shot. Yeah. It's fun though, the pearls are pretty cool actually. They look like angels to me. I never even noticed that before. They look like aliens with jetpacks, and some of them look like angels. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, he tongued it right out. Hopefully it's going to be one of these ones that splits a shot. Nah. That's unfortunate. If we actually killed that way fast, if I got that last fucking alien, we could have actually used it up. No. Couldn't get it. I just hope this car, uh, this ROM holds up now. I'll be disappointed. Yeah. You never know when this game's gonna break down. I shouldn't say that, Rick, because I'll probably jinx it. Show it up. Okay, he's alive. Does this one have a boss fight on the end? Oh, this one is a nuisance. There's no good way to fight this guy. Not that I know. See? You've got to try to bait it left and right. Ah, uh, it's. As long as you both hit it, like, every time he's moving, it should be alright. Get in the middle on that, this bit. You can basically kill him in, like, one or two... I always just go... I just guess I go left, right, and just go fucking... Then you YOLO this last bit. You just gotta go in the middle and smash the shit out of it. Got it. Alright, we're almost done, I think. And the end of music for this game is amazing. Yeah, last boss. I guess this is supposed to be um, Event Horizon, like the like a, everything getting pulled into the middle, maybe? Yeah. It kind of works though, because you know, it's like, it comes full circle, doesn't it? Come on! Oh god, how I caught that on the side? I do not know. Oh, I don't like shields! Yeah, it's crap. Josh, you have a power up. Do I have a power up? It gave me the, it gave me a timer for a power up, but um, but it was a shield, wasn't it? Right. This is quite an easy one. You just basically stay in the middle because you, you know you're gonna hit something. No. Get that ship again. I got it. Right. Don't get hit. Oh, he's getting low, this one. Alright. Do you have a power-up? No, Okay, so we need that for the last boss. Damn it. Oh, my accuracy is sh- I don't shit. There he is, there's the bad boy. Get in the middle, smash the shit out of him. You can. He's got like this kind of plasma breath as well as kind of cool. Yeah. Right. It does, he is badass looking. It's cool. With double shot though, you can make fast work of him. Yeah. Predicting a bit easier. Oh, I lost my shot. Oh, I'm doing crap. Dude. There you go, game over. Did alright. Listen, the last alien mothership was destroyed by the brave Maverick Six Fighter. The robotic control ship with no fleet left began to break up. It slowly drifted towards Earth. This music's cool as well. I'm researching the Earth's atmosphere. It burnt up. Uh, reaching, sorry. Uh, the end of the invasion. The Earth is safe. Hey, Josh, we saved the world today. What did you do? Who's ever watching today? Yeah. Again, I got another run at this, but I had to do the single player one. We didn't get to see the cow level, though. Should we, should we play to get to a cow level? No, the cow level shows up after every stage. 
Oh, actually, I can't be bothered. People are probably not interested. <laughs> I like the same music, though, but the, the PAL version was slowed down. It sounded a bit better. Yeah. Type your name, Josh. Let's see if there's any more story. There you go. That's, um... Look at that. That was cool. So now we're going to jump into the PS1 version, which ha actually adds more strategy, where, like I said earlier, you've got to try and match four aliens together. And then you earn that power up. So it's quite fun. It's quite short. And uh, it's just cool, you know? So we'll be playing the PS1 version in literally two minutes. Written by. I love that. There's a writing credit for this game. Aliens are invading the world, and you've got to kind of shoot them down out of the sky. <laughs> Developed by the Kremlin, is that what I said? <laughs> Fucking hell. The Gremlin or Kremlin? The Kremlin made this. Okay. Anyway, I love this game growing up. This is an absolute nostalgic game. This is one of the first games I ever played as a kid. Gotta be. This and Alex Kid in Miracle World. Right, anyway, we're gonna be jumping onto the PS1 version now, so that'd be cool. 